we're heading out on deliveries in the D-Max today. Really has slowed up now. Um, it's just a couple of bags uh, today and a couple of bags tomorrow. We are doing quite a lot of loose loads tomorrow of unseasoned stuff um, that people are going to season themselves. So that's going to be quite good. Um, but yeah, it's really slowed up and the kiln dried, which is quite handy because the kiln isn't full yet. I'm going to load it up um, probably tomorrow. So um, yeah, Jack's doing well, processing lots of um, beach. Morning guys, it's uh, Thursday morning. We're just heading out on delivery. Um, having some real trouble uploading my YouTube videos at the moment. It's just taking forever for them up to upload. So um, sorry about the delay. I'm trying to do like a couple of videos a week, but it's just um, becoming quite, quite a challenge. Anyway, um, yesterday I was ringing up some uh, some big rings ready for the demo machine to come from Fuelwood the Splitter 400 on a petrol power pack so because of the delays of my new machine they have offered me this machine just for a couple of weeks um, to run alongside the, the Transor so that's really good of them um, just try and get ahead a little bit and use some of the big bits that won't go through the new machine anyway. Um, so that's quite handy. So we're just ringing up big rings, anything over kind of 18 inches. Um, I'm just splitting in half of an act. But the, um, the steel 462 sounds bloody good with the Bart box from West Coast Saws. So enjoy the video. So I'm going to start ringing up the other side now. I'm just looking here at the measurements. We cut our logs to about 23 centimetres. And the end of the handle is 22. So that's close enough for me. I'm going to cut everything to the end of the handle. And uh, that gives us a nice even product.
that's it for this video guys thanks for watching uh, certainly sounds good don't you think me and Woody are out on delivery still uh, but we'll catch you on the next one cheers